हेलो चिल्ड्रन आपके लेसन 15 में देखेंगे द बर्ड मैन ऑफ इंडिया और बर्ड मैन ऑफ इंडिया को अभी हम सिर्फ पढ़ेंगे आप भी ध्यान दीजिए किताबों पे अपनी पेंसिल रेडी रखिए और उसके बाद कौन है ये बर्ड मैन और क्या कुछ है इनके बारे में क्यों ये आपके लेसन में इनका नाम आ रहा है ये हम सब जानने की कोशिश करेंगे एक छोटी सी डॉक्यूमेंट्री के माध्यम से लेकिन पहले सिर्फ इसको रीड करेंगे यू मस्ट हैव सीन पीपल वर्शिपिंग बर्ड्स ट्रीज एंड एनिमल्स इन मेनी प्लेसेस आफ्टर ऑब्जर्विंग दिस यू मस्ट हैव वंडर्ड एज टू वाई पीपल वर्शिप नेचर एंड ईजी आंसर टू दिस क्वेश्चन इज बिकॉज आवर एंसेस्टर्स डिड इट अ लॉन्ग लॉन्ग टाइम अ गो worshipping birds trees and animals were ways devised by our ancestors to respect our ecology this was also meant to prevent human greediness from destroying our natural wealth unfortunately if we look at the present situation birds and their habitations have faced much destruction there are there are about 9000 species of birds and their size varies from 5 cm to over 2.5 meters the hummingbird is one of the smallest species of birds and the ostrich which reaches a height of over 8 feet is the largest bird on the planet there are birds which are known for their swiftness such as the eagle and the hawk there are other birds such as the vulture which are known for flying at high altitudes there are also several birds which have lost the power of flight such as the ostrich the emu and the kiwi birds are called winged bipeds the body temperature of birds remains more or less constant another interesting feature about birds is their feathers observing the feathers of a bird gives us an idea about the life that they lead birds have beaks they have no teeth their main food consists of insects food grains and flesh like reptiles birds too lay eggs they have a keen sense of sight and hearing but their sense of smell and taste is poor birds have the wonderful capacity of adjusting their vision quickly as a result they can shift their focus from a distant object to a nearby object in a fraction of a second in india the world of birds are exposed to us by the great salim ali's contribution he is affectionately known as the bird man of india salim ali was born on 12th november 1896 His maternal uncle Amiruddin Tayyab ji brought him up. His uncle was a hunter and a nature lover. Under his guidance, Salim learned to hunt and appreciate the nature around him. As a child, Salim Ali shot a bird which had a yellow streak running below its neck. The uncle could not identify the species and advised him to contact the Bombay Natural History Science BNHS in Mumbai. Dr W S Millard the honorary secretary of BNHS identified the bird as a yellow throated sparrow he also showed Salim Ali the society's splendid collection of stuffed birds the single incident changed Salim Ali's life and india got its best ornithologist as a result when Salim Ali said my chief interest in study of birds has been the opportunity to observe the birds life history under natural conditions and not in the laboratory under a microscope by traveling to remote uninhabited places i can study the birds as they live and behave in their natural habitat salim ali received honors and medals from all over the world for his service including the j paul getty international award the golden ark of international union for conservation of nature the golden medal of the british ornithology union a rarity for non british people and padma shri and padma vibhushan from indian government his timely intervention saved the bharatpur bird sanctuary and the silent valley national park his famous book the book of indian birds is a bible for budding ornithologists 
He passed away in 1987 at the age of 91. He is no more, but his legacy lives on. His dedication to ornithology has left behind committed groups of amateur bird watchers all over India. एक बार आप लोग इसको पढ़ के देखिए साइलेंटली रीड करके देखिए फिर हम इसको समझने की कोशिश करेंगे आपके नेक्स्ट वीडियो में